in my previous video I have shown you uh, how I added these pictures in my articles and how I removed the background of these pictures uh, using this Microsoft Word uh, application only. It's very easy and uh, it's not complicated and anyone can anyone can do this simple task using Microsoft Word and make these kinds of magazines or these kinds of uh, you know articles. You can write or design your own article using Microsoft Word very easily. If you don't check my previous videos, go and check my those videos and it will be very helpful for you. Um, if you are a beginner, that will be very helpful for you. So in my today's video, I'm going to show you some more steps, uh, some more editing steps uh, using Microsoft Word. Uh, in your pictures, or how can you add your pictures and decorate your uh, articles very easily using only Microsoft Word. So without any further delay, let's get started with the video. So uh, first I'm going to insert a picture uh, here in this page. I have removed the previous picture. So let's insert a picture here. Okay. So I have insert a picture here and let's um, do some editing. So I'm going to double click here. Then you can find a tab as I have uh, shown you in the previous video. So here are some picture styles. Here you can find some picture style. Like this is a simple frame. This is also a simple frame. Whenever you put your cursor over the styles, it will show the preview of your picture. You don't have to click. The, you, you, before applying any style, you can simply see the preview whenever you just put, the, put your cursor. Okay, this is another frame, metal frame. This is drop shadow. As you can see, there are some shadows behind the picture and under the picture you can find the shadow. So this is a reflected, rounded, rectangular picture. This is something like faded picture. Um, it's like the picture's background is faded with your page. This is uh, giving you the soft edge type of effect and this is a double frame. You, you can find more effect whenever you click here. There are many, many, many more effects and picture frame. You can go and check those picture frame and add according to your choice or according to your context. I'm going to add this soft edge rectangular shape for this time. So as you can see, the picture uh, is now faded and it's kind of like faded with your background. Okay, this is this is giving you that effect. So yeah, there are some effects. Uh, there are any, another option that is color. You can also change the color saturation of your picture. This is a more vibrant type of uh, saturation. This is giving you the vibrant types of effect. This is a more vibrant type of effects. Um, this is this is this is like a black and white type of effect. So here is the saturation, uh, less saturation. That means zero percent saturation, and this is the hundred percent saturation. So if you want to make your picture a little bit bright, so you can increase your saturation. Like this is three hundred percent saturation, and this is too bright. And if you want a little less bright or if you want a darker your picture then you have to put the less saturation mode okay so i'm going to make it bright <clears throat> so there are more color and brightness contrasted option you can see by yourself uh, you can filter or edit your pictures or make uh, give any kind of effect to your picture if you come here and there is another option that is color you can Okay, we, we were given saturation from the color option and there is another option that is correctness. So this is soft. There is soft. If you want to make your picture a little bit soft or blur, you can choose the soft option. And if you want to make it more sharper, like your picture is a little bit blur, you want to make it sharper, then you can choose this sharpen option. As you can see, the bricks of the picture is more sharp than before now as you can see this is more sharp and if you simply 
it was the normal normal mode and this is the sharpen mode uh, I, I guess you guys can understand the changes and if you make it blur you can see this is giving you a blur effect the picture is a blur the details are not that much uh, th there is no detailed work is blah 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 everything but if you want more detailed picture then you can choose the sharp option so that is so much sharp so this was the normal i'm going to make it a bit bit less sharper uh, okay so this is fine this is good to go okay so yeah that's that's it for this picture and there are some artistic effect you can add but not recommended for this kind of article okay so yeah uh, in this way you can edit your picture and I have show you some uh, this position how can you position your pictures in my previous videos you can check my those videos as well so yeah now uh, if you uh, like uh, if you have set this picture and give some effects but uh, you can understand that uh, this picture was a wrong picture like for architecture you don't want this picture you have to like uh, you, it, it mean by mistakenly you put this picture here but your client is asking for you to change the picture so how can you change the picture and exactly in the same position this is very simple you just have to select your picture and you will find the option like change picture now choose any picture from your computer insert as you can see all the effects are remain the same just the picture has been changed the border the sharper border uh, if you if you uh, check the sharper border was remain the same the uh, this was okay as you can see your effect remains the same just the picture has been changed okay so in this way you can just simply change your picture uh, using this change picture option now if you want that uh, you will want to reset the picture reset the effect of the picture reset the picture and size in this uh, what you can do for that so like I'm going to work for this picture now so just select the picture if you want uh, you want to remove remove all the effects that was given the given in this picture so you have to go to the reset picture option as you can see your picture has been resetted all the effects I have uh, give here or I have put here all the pictures effects has been gone and my picture has um, turned into uh, as it was the regular mode or if, if, if this is this was the original picture you can also resize the picture size as well okay so this was the size whenever i place the picture initially so i am i don't want that so this is more good okay so yeah in this way you can resize your picture and there's another option that is compress picture so I apply it to only to this picture okay you can compress your picture as well so so that sorry so yeah uh, these things you can do with your pictures and I'm going to end this video for this time and I have uh, I don't want to make this article so much uh, so much complicated because this video is beginner friendly so I want to make this simple as uh, as I can uh, in my next project or in my next video or I will make make some interesting or make anything complex as uh, these videos are my initial videos so I want to make this simple and as easy as I can so if you find my video helpful for you guys please do subscribe and uh, hit the notification bell button and please don't forget to like my video and comment in the comment section bye for this time bye